Jordy gets a box. Starting point for my box peak adventure. Cool buildings. Hey, you! Hold on. What's your name? Jordy Defective A. Defective A. Yeah. You can stop looking for your box porter, you little knucklehead. We found it this morning. Uh, wait. I'm not gonna report you to the BPO or anything, but you really need to take care of this. It's worth probably 60,000 marbles. What? O okay, thank you, sir, for finding this thing that is mine. Bye! That's a weird last name. Hey! Hey, you play Box Peak? No. Yes, you do. You have a box porter. This is for Box Peak? Yeah. Can I tell you something? Some guy just handed it to me because it has my name on it. I mean, I'm from Fairboat Island. Isn't Box Peak illegal there? Yes. Your parents are gonna be so mad? No! Don't tell my parents. They think I'm on a super long field trip. I don't... I don't even know what this does. It's a box porter, dummy. You wear it on your wrist, press that button, and it summons your box instantly. From where? From the basement fortress. You mean the boxes just magically teleport? It's not magic, but yeah. What else can you do with it? Nothing. It's only for Box Peak. They don't teach you any of this on Fairboat Island? No. Hey, um, what's your name? CD. Hi, CD. I'm Jordy. Do you have time to sit down and slowly explain everything about Box Peak to me? For sure. Now, Jordy, don't! That's how you issue a challenge! I accept your challenge! What? I accept your challenge! Uh, I didn't mean to! Is this kid new? Just forfeit while you have the chance. No way! CD, please, tell me what to do. Okay, we have a little bit of time before the peak ref gets here. What's a peak ref? It's a floating robot that referees the match. You have floating robots here? Just for box peak. Okay, so both opponents start by porting in their boxes. There are two ways to win. Peek at your opponent's box for four seconds, that's a complete peak, or catch your opponent peeking, that's a counter peak. So it's a game about peeking? Uh-huh. There are three more important rules. You can retreat from a peak, but only after at least two seconds. If you retreat, you have to wait six seconds until you can peak again. Finally, you could put anything in your box that fits in your box. Got it. What was the first rule again? Beep, beep, beep. Peak Rep 12 reporting in. Who are the competitors? Me, Victor Ross. Victor Ross, Vanilla Tier. 51,198 points. That's right. Oh, no. And I'm Jordy Defective A. Player not found. Would you like to create a record? Yes. Beep, 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 beep. Registration complete. Congratulations. Your Box Peak adventure begins today. Jordy Defective A, Banana Tier, zero points. CD, that's a real robot? Yes. Hello, robot. Hello. Do you like Box Peak? Cease this. Jordy, you're not allowed to ask them questions. Sorry, sorry, robot. Competitors, summon your boxes. <laughs> the match will begin on my mark. Three, two, one, go! Ah, finally an easy win, Victor. Every newbie ever counts to five or six before peaking. 
thinking they'll catch an old pro like me being aggressive. Kinda of feel bad, but I should pop up on the seventh second. No sense in getting his hopes up. Everybody's gotta lose their first match, though. It's kind of a right at Box Peak. Now, how many seconds has it been? Three? Okay, I think I have a little cranberry soda left in here. Four! What? Complete peak! Jordy Defective A wins! You're telling me he just peaked the whole time? I didn't get the rules. Competitor Defective A receives six points. Competitor Ross loses six points. I'm only worth six points? What is this? Competitor Ross deducted 500 additional points for aggressive questioning. Match over! No, dang it, wait! Bye, robot! Jordy, that was a gutsy move. Only professionals try stuff like that. Thanks, that was really fun. Can you teach me more about Box Peak? Sure, if you promise to challenge me too when you're ready. You got it. Hey, Jordy. I don't have a lot of Box Peak friends. Most of the kids who play are pretty mean. Yeah, kids are mean everywhere. And um, in every town I stop in on my Box Peak adventure, I rent a hotel room. I have one here in Certainly City, so you can stay in mine if you want. How do you afford that? Both my parents died three years ago at the zoo. I got a lot of money because of that, so I just used it to travel around Let's Go Island playing Box Peak. CD, I'll be your Box Peak friend. Thanks. Also, I've been meaning to ask, what happens if nobody peeks? Jordy! You have the craziest questions. That has literally never happened. Let me tell you what did happen, though. There was this lady. Everybody knew her. I'm sorry, honey. I... I totally forgot. Are they mad? Well, yeah. I've been trying to recoup 500 freaking points I lost for talking back to the peak ref. I know I'm not supposed to talk to them. They just... they tick me off. So I'm gonna need to get in a few more matches before I can call it a night. Tell them the truth. You... Your... parents... don't know I... still play box peak. What, like you're ashamed? I'm vanilla tear. Oh, I accept your challenge. Honey, I gotta go. I love you. Put some in the fridge. I love you. Bye. Hey, you little creep. I was talking to my wife. No, she made me sad. Shut up. I accept your challenge.